At COP28, countries are gathering together to take action towards achieving the world's collective climate goals as agreed upon under the Paris Agreement and the Convention. And NOAA is right there, participating with a small delegation that includes climate experts and leaders. It is going really well. We have over 25 side events, and I feel like I get a request for us to do a new one every single hour at this point. We are providing our science in all of these discussions. We are trying to make sure that there are science-based decisions that is based on the best available science, as is required by the Paris Accord. And we're having these engagements across all different types of partnerships, across different sectors, public and private, but then also with our counterparts across many different governments. There's so much interest and engagement and excitement around the science of NOAA and using that science for decisions, be it decisions on policy, decisions on new types of regulations, but also on financial decisions, corporates wanting to our information and our science to figure out how can they invest in climate solutions going forward. There is so much focus on ocean solutions right now that everyone is talking about it. People are really interested in how can we use the ocean? How do we manage it better? How do we have the science of the ocean to be able to leverage it for all different types of solutions that we need? There's just so much excitement around it right now and we need to take that excitement and move it into action. As we work to build the climate ready nation here at home, the No Delegation is hopeful that the same model can be employed abroad as well. Everywhere I go, they talk about how NOAA science is the best in class and how people see it and they want to expand upon it, they want to be a part of it and they want to partner on it.